like I said, that'll come in time. I would just show progress pictures because I was a cosplayer before a VTuber anyway. So I need to promote that side considering how when it's not con season, I am dead silent on that end. All right. Team player Stagger Swagger. A Stagger Swagger game makes me think I want to go Octavia and say, you have to deal with me one way or another here. Unironically, Zerasmus can draw some attention or so, but I think with it being on here, this is very much so something that I can just say, what are you going to do? Uh, what don't I want to deal with otherwise? Let's just take, like, Julie out just as a binary. I can always get rid of Zen, but I'm just thinking, like, uh, you know, awakening-wise more than anything when it comes to it. We do have Luna here, which I can be counterproductive to the Luna game plan, but it's Tatra Swagger. If people aren't taking it besides the goalie, uh, you know, it's viable because team player is absolutely a really good awakening, I but I feel like I could get away with a lot of stupid shenanigans on this end as Octavia to just force my face in and say, you have to deal with me. Inside of that, I can also go Era too when it comes to, but I'm more comfortable on Octavia than Era for her speed striker setups. Oh, we have somebody inactive. Well, that's not happening then. Alrighty, Chief. This is the second- Is somebody destroyed AFK in the queues? Like, what's going on here? Okay, well, at least I got an instant queue pop, but I guess we're not gonna have another Quarian run back. Just anything but Oni Village. Omega Strikers, gods, please. Zeus, take Oni Village out of the game and my life is yours. Please? Taiko! I haven't played Taiko in a while. It's my next weakest map, but I can deal with this to an extent. I'm thinking extra special rune to absolutely cause chaos. Does it either that or I just go Dubu, but I'm more comfortable in rune than Dubu in any retrospect at all. Uh, so let's just go ahead and take Dubu out then, because either of those traits would really suck to go against, and none of us are indicating that we want to do so, and I am not going to deal with that. No now, for a time was created too, I can see. I so let's do this thing, let's do this thing, let's win. see how stupid this can be. So the question is, Swookies or Pummelers? I think Pummelers potentially would be really stupid. Hi Crimson, hope you're doing well. Considering how this could be absolutely a wild game for kills flying off the bands. And if I can just get that little bit more not back to guarantee that if somebody wants to stay to the sides and I just shut them out, then it's all over, Chief. Let's cause chaos. Now, it is Luna Ets 2, but I'm Rune. I have a lot more propensity to shut them down more before offensive game points can trigger. Hello. Maybe. <laughs> Sounds like fun. We will see, though. We will see, though. <coughs> Era Luna Ets. Era Goey question mark potentially? I can see Luna Goey, of course, as the primary option. We'll see, but that's a special rune, yeah. Yeah, a jet buttons time. otherwise. All anonymous names, hilariously. Okay, Pummer's Era Siphoning Ets. This is gonna be a ball to the walls game, but let's see how this goes. Yeah, Extra Special is in town, ladies and gentlemen. So it's really gonna come down to how much of a general nuisance I can potentially be. Let's go ahead and set up Shadow on their side. I can't believe you were almost able to carry that out. Cover the ends. Great play by me. Now I have all propensity to start moving up here. And seeing if I could have Shadow be a potential problem. I need to move further in the back. Get to this side if I can. Let's just go ahead and stagger Ets out with my anomaly, because I don't mind burning it if I can just make him uncomfortable to play the game. Fine by me. I got my hits that I wanted right there. Oh, I didn't get my net send up, but it's fine. Oh, what? She actually played around my angle without really even having to think about it. Oh my goodness, and the fact that nobody's gotten anything going yet is hilarious. Great demon angles all throughout. Wow, guys, that's hilarious! That is absolutely an amazing round one for Muna. I mean, great it is the goal clear to I guess hit the Taito more than anything. For Muna getting around my anomaly, which I thought was just gonna be a straight up checkmate at that point, then. Alright, have fun, Era. Not enough pushy yet, but that's 
that's dangerous spotting and then just play to the taiko yeah he didn't expect that bounce i didn't take i i was about to say team fire was the last game i didn't take team fire but you weren't expecting that now were you maybe it's because i'm fresh on it only villages i still hate but taiko because because i'm not playing somebody who has to bash their face in all the time i'm more than eager to just be fine Alright, let's move forwards just for a little bit more burst energy potentially. Fine enough. Very, very, very fine. Oh. Oh, bounce to me. There you go. Not yet. But we still got it. Alright, alright, alright. I might have messed up my initial strike, but immediately right there. This is really difficult for them. Because Era can try to beat me to the ball, but I'm just going to banish her. I can just put a creation behind me. X is going against Juno. Sets in general, more than anything. And you know, it's that's just how life's going. That's just how life's going right now. Let's see what Juno wants then. Because Luna, unless you want to be, have a dead draft and take Monumental is the way, you're not going to have much fun, all things considered here. So then, they're going to profit, I feel. Yes, X could take Flight or Chrono Boost, either or, to shore up the fact that he doesn't have Swickies, but we're coming out with three amazing best in slots. Because Seed's Machine means Asher with her own extra special, and you're not getting past her. You're not getting past me. Juno can actually just pass to herself, and it gets going. This is going to be stupid. Annoying. Well, let's just go ahead and have the anomaly be made, so I don't have to deal with it. Thank you. That is wonderful. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Turnabout is fair play, of course. I didn't want to press my evade button necessarily just because I didn't necessarily feel a need to. Taiko bounces are wild enough, though. But if I can get past that around, though. X dies as soon as he came back. Hilariously. Hilariously, X is already gone. Top cut, and then... <laughs> Get to play the game, dude. He died thanks to Asher weighing into them. It's after I took all the hits to Jolten for us. Yeah, Ed wanted to look at me. Asher said no dice, and then he died immediately afterwards. Oh, that's unfortunate on all your pets there. Good clipping that way. Uh, that way you save your era's life. That's difficult though. I can't believe Ed actually got that hit. I didn't think he had enough size. Alright, in that case then, maybe I should, like, if it spawns down below at me then, and see Era charging up, I probably should just go ahead and just press the banish button immediately, or I should just try to clip the core. Yeah, a clip like that would be amazing for us. Oh, thank you. Uh, I should have just done the anomaly immediately. Good stalling. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Wonder I was hoping for a better pass back, but that's totally fine on all the guards. Just look at how difficult it is for you to have to deal now. Good patience. Really good patience. Oh, lovely stuff again. Oh. Sorry. I want to just get past Etz on this regard here. Keep it low. Low and difficult. I was hoping for the blob to pass up to me, but it's fine. This is not fine. This is... This is dangerous spotting. But I could ego! Was it the right eat? What the heck was that hit? I was about to say, if I immediately anomalied and then just placed myself back to fall back to the defensive line, I think I should have had something there. What a absolute hit. I can't say much about that. Can you just stop spawning down here, please? I'd really appreciate it. Like, a lot. I think the play here is legitimately just to kill Luna. Kill Luna sooner or later. Nice to mid Ets. I'm still living here. Sorry. Oh, they still got it. Not the best straight shot, I will be honest with you. Lock the corner. Great stuff! Great stuff! Great old Jito. You know. There was just out of that round. Very, very good stuff. Alright. We are fine. I survived the storm right there. Let's see if I can't get a kill. Because I have... Dude, I, I need the core to stop spawning over here. Like, legitimately. That's to die. That's did not die. This hurts our game plan of killing Eds. This hurts our game plan of winning the set. Have to cover the bottom, no doubt. 
Really, really good anomaly challenge by me. I have to drag it. Yep, Juno has to toss her spec one way or another. Oh, what a tight angle. I feel like we're just getting... Wait, all three of those goals were us just getting clipped on the wildest angles, dude. Which has been annoying. Okay, so... Hot shot without a doubt for me. I think it's that or rapid fire. One of those two. I think... Uh, yeah, Juno wants that then. In that case, rapid fire for me. Alright, well, in that case, then I'm taking rapid fire one way or another. Because more hits, more hits, more hits always will just be the big thing. It's two size traits, so I can't deny Ets necessarily what it comes to, but it's either getting CDR, CDR, or CDR, one way or another, is really what it comes to be. I just don't know what Juno necessarily wants. If she just wants, yeah, to fall back for the orbs or everything, or if she just wants more consistent, insistent tempo. But hopefully, prime time will allow me to just win first touches more often against Era, and we can just span a victory condition off of that. So I'll be able to support Juno on this end too, when it comes to it. And maybe get more cheesy kills like that, if it allows me to do so. Because with me having banishes, I should be getting a kill just about every round, almost. And that is an amazing anomaly by me to disrupt your hit! That is great! Alright, well that did it, baby, that did it! I mean, they say that when they just equalize the set 1-1, but you know how I mean. Yeah, Prime Town wants me to basically really have things ready almost again. I need to just clip Luna in one of those sometimes. The fact that everything got eaten otherwise really hurts. Alright, just keep cutting the t uh, just keep cutting on the opposite angle though, and make it hard for them to want to tend otherwise. There you go, good, 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 good. Potions ones are so nice. It like people, which I, you're using an almost to cover your angles so much that the better end that I've worn from watching other runes and being destroyed by other runes exactly so is to just challenge it as a range strike exactly so. If I can draw your attention and say this is a range strike and you have to respect this one way or another, or else you die, then well, or else they die. Sim simple enough as that, you know. Let's. Ooh, good burst by. Good burst by Luna to keep herself alive. I should have fallen back on the defensive line without a doubt there. Nope. I'm not running my wars. Ooh, I do like that straight send idea there. Fall back. I would like the orb to get the stall going, but this is fine either way. I was hoping we could get it to Juno first. Okay, but that's fine! Great shadow tempo point! Great shadow tempo! Alright! We are locking it in! We are making it problematic for them. Deserved MVP for me. Let's see what's left up here. <laughs> Cast a last being here is way, way wicked, way stupid. I could take Missile Propulsion away from Luna, but being able to have my creations last longer, and also, you know, banish last and longer retroactively too, is going to be so stupid, because I just, what, without, lock somebody away, say you don't get to play, so what are you gonna do next? You can't Unstoppable necessarily, so it'll just block one hit, and it doesn't block the banish, so I think we'll be fine on this end. Era does have two size traits now, but size and bigger size means bigger hitbots for you, so let's see how that pans out. And that does also have stat responder, which shorts up his weakness. But if I just hit him, burst him, and then he dies, then, you know, he dies. Go ahead, put my creation out on the table here. Just say whatever to it. Era used her thing, so not that she can really do much here anymore. And then I just challenge with my face. I'll continue to challenge with my face. And you're seeing how it's hard it is for them to play now. Absolute opposite ends of the spectrum from set two to where we are now, set three, set four, just being able to contest them and say, yeah, you cannot play on, a, on an entire half of the field practically is wildly stupid. I'm just gonna steal the orb from Luna. Try striking from range. Okay, as much as as funny and as much damage as I had been doing, kills are definitely not the game plan here. <laughs> Look at me, all you want after all of that. Yes, 
last one! We're still here! We're still alive! We're still winning! You didn't even get to kill me, suckers! Hydroplay is always what potentially there. I need to evade for my own life. Is a problem point, right? That is a problem point. Oh, gotta, gotta keep it up for us, without a doubt. Good salvage, good salvage. And the fact that Luna missed two is absolutely tremendous for us. Great send. Great dodge by me. Walk them away. Decent enough. And then... <laughs> it's like Juno presented the most diabolical one-two. Well deserved right there, because she set up the Blobo and moved down, so Luna was split between going down to guard Juno or keeping the corner. You can't blame her for that, that was diabolical, and that was a drown out! A drown out, thanks to Banish! <laughs> oh, that is absolutely stupid. Well deserved to my teammates right there too. We all understood the game plan past set 2 afterwards, and like I said, even if I only got two shards, the fear of God was in them. They couldn't do as much as they wanted to. That's a special rune, baby. Absolutely ridiculous.